Hello, it's Catherine here coming um, with the next daily devotion. Um, and yesterday we did uh, Palm Sunday, um, celebrating Jesus, our King Jesus. And in Sunday school, the children uh, made these little crosses. And each little block of the cross is a story leading up to um, Jesus' death on the cross. Um, so yesterday, um, in our devotion, we spoke about Jesus coming as a donkey, as our king, and all the people um, putting palm leaves down um, and worshipping him as king. Uh, some people rejected that, and um, Jesus wept and said to them, even the stones will cry out and praise me. And he wept because he had come for them, and they didn't know he was the Messiah or didn't recognize him as their Messiah um, and he wept for them, and he wept for Jerusalem. And so now he's on his journey um, into Jerusalem, and of course the place that he goes to um, is a temple, his father's house. And as he enters, I'm reading from Luke chapter 19, from verses 45 to the end of chapter 19. And he entered the temple and began to drive out those who were selling saying to them, It is written, My house shall be a house of prayer, but you have made it a den of robbers. And he was teaching daily in the temple. The chief priests and the scribes and the principal men of the people were seeking to destroy him, but they did not find anything they could do, for all the people were hanging on his words. I'll read it again. And he entered the temple and began to drive out those who sold, saying to them, It is written, My house shall be a house of prayer. But you have made it a den of robbers. And he was teaching daily in the temple. The chief priests and the scribes and the principal men of the people were seeking to destroy him. But they did not find anything they could do. For all the people were hanging on his words. The beautiful thing about this story is um, Jesus didn't just enter the physical temple, but he also wants to enter um, our temples because our bodies are the temples of the Holy Spirit. And um, as he was entering, and we open our hearts entering Jerusalem and the palm leaves. Are down and we're saying okay Jesus um, come into my heart we now say okay come into my temple <laughs> come into me we welcome him in and as he comes in um, we must expect that he's going to drive out things that he doesn't want there anymore and um, things that um, we might have hidden in the dark um, that other people don't know about um, but as we welcome Jesus in, he will drive out the things that he doesn't want in our heart, the doubt, the fear, um, anything, uh, the worries, the concerns. Um, we must welcome him to drive out the things that are not of him and to fill our hearts anew with everything that is of him. And then I like how it ends. Um, it says that we're hanging on his words, on his every word. Um, so as we clean out our hearts and our inner temple, um, let us hang on every word, on, on every word um, that brings us hope, that brings us healing, uh, that brings us restoration. So may the story bless you.